Prepare for a whirlwind of Karen encounters. Unhinged Karen's uncalled for rage impacts everyone around her. Entitled Karen wants first responders to move their car. Upset they're inconveniencing her. Selfish Karen is upset over a man walking with his service dog. Karen launches after an innocent teen teasing her on an electric scooter. Karen's oppose a pavement basketball hoop. Not happy kids are having fun. Car Karen goes wild while claiming someone stole her parking space. Karen in San Francisco gets angry over a parking spot. I can't help you. You just stole my. Shut up. Okay. I can't help you. Okay, I'm listening. Okay. You're very upset. You have a baby in the car. I understand, but you need to think about how you're escalating this. Okay. He's it's, escalating. It's, I asked him to let me park because I was here first. Here. Here. If you he cool. he didn't park here, if I you're asked you're him. Here. I was very cool. No, I told you I was I here first. No, you no. started stealing my spot. Lady, this is not your spot. You are stealing. You. Lady, I claimed it lady. first. You have a big I claimed it oh, first. Have, I have a kid in the car. I was here first. Get out. Get out. I was here I'm first. I'm here already. I was here first. This lady started yelling at my four-year-old daughter. So that's when I left. Male Karen won't let this woman get out of her car and park outside his house, despite her having every legal right to do so, and police are called. This is my neighbor who's standing in front of my car right now, not letting me park in front of my house. They don't want me to park here. I'm going to park here though. <laughs> They'll see. They're so angry, I don't know why. Well, I guess I get him. They're making me block traffic because they're refusing to move in front of my car. <laughs> the police are on their way. I live right there and I've lived there for seven years. I've lived there for longer than him. But he doesn't want me to park in front of his house because he apparently has five cars that he needs to park here. <laughs> so they're trying to bully me which they do to every neighbor they leave nasty notes on every neighbor's car swearing at people not to park in front of their house opening she opened my car door <laughs> this guy where's your car it's not here it's not here it's empty and someone wants to park it that's too bad Call the bylaws and go come get it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's, that's up to the city bylaws. You gotta call them. Let's do that. Get a sign here that says residents of this block only. Get a sign. My God, it's our destiny. Okay, well, she's working here. It's too late. Why it's too late? Because I've been here for half an hour. Okay, I'm gonna park while you're still here so that they don't do the same. Did you leave? Doing the rest of your life. Yeah, okay. Life. Yeah, okay. 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 <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. Unhinged Karen screams at everyone within her vicinity with rage that is completely uncalled for. A photograph! Three, you're not allowed! Four, you would yell that! Grow up real quick, stop yelling. You grow up! You're an illegal photographer! Get out! Illegal, illegal photographer. photographer. Excuse me, grow up, man. Grow up. Grow up. Illegal photographing trespassing! Grow up, bro. Right, the no, you're not! You're doing again to I do something to stop it! Get off! We're leaving, we're leaving. Wanna give me your name? So you can explain your story? Yeah, Jeffrey. Jeffrey what? Hamilton. Jeffrey, Jeffrey, Jeffrey's a you photographer? Yeah. Give me your car! You can't take photography! Parents are often so eager to yell at someone that they're happy to do so, even when no one is listening. We can't answer the door right now, but if you'd like to leave a message, you can do it now. No, I've listened to your dogs bark every minute of every day for two years. You come out and talk to me. Hi, 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 hi. Please come out. I've listened to your dogs bark every minute for two years. You will come talk to me. 
or calling the police. Come talk to me. Male Karen won't listen to this man asking him nicely to fix the issue he's caused. Got him. Yes, sir, that's not where the car goes, sir. What are you sticking on that car? It's a bumper magnet, sir. It's got our, uh... Do that uh, again. Number. Why is that, sir? Do you need... you have that one? Don't you ever touch my car? What's wrong with your car, sir? Ridiculous. Well, sir, you left your car out where it could touch other people's cars, sir. Pardon me, let me... It's got our phone number on it. No, sir, I want you to call... Then get the hell away. I want you to... Don't give a damn. What you did is harass me. No, it's not, sir. Yes, it is. That car could harass somebody. What do you... Why do you keep approaching me, sir? Because I'm fixing it. Stay away from me. Sir, that cart, will you take your cart back where it belongs, sir? Please. In the name of Texas, I beg you, sir. I'm a nice guy, not an effing a-hole. Sure you don't want this, sir? I don't understand it. Crazy car Karen causes incredible damage to someone else's car and doesn't care. What in the okay, world? Yeah. Wait till end. And it was an accident. That's what it's called, an accident. Girl, you're the one that hit her. Don't try to I know, but she doesn't have to yell at me. I've got insurance that will come and fix in her car. So would you like a picture of my insurance? This Karen front desk employee won't be winning any awards for customer service anytime soon. I can leave for all you care? Is this how you treat? What? Okay. And I don't... No, I have the call record. Okay, so you're treating... Karen yells at this driver for revving his car engine. You ready? It's all for Karen. All for Karen. Number one, okay. number two, you don't disrespect a mature okay. woman, okay? okay. Thank you. And you better chill out okay. because my son is here, and if he hears okay. me yelling at you, he'll come and he'll break your head. Okay. Okay? Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Have some respect. Okay. If my son comes down, you're in big trouble, let me tell you. Okay. Story time on how a wretched neighbor Karen got her deserved Karen karma. Hello, my name is Lewis, and I'm going to tell you the story of how my few neighbors, my Karen, got karma. Don't mess with good people. You can't mess with God's people. The way I'm looking at it is your actual fence line. That's the problem y'all have it. Y'all keep running your mouth and, okay. and get yourself into more stuff. So okay. let me explain this to you, please, before you shut up. Okay. Okay. This is a drainage ditch. That is a drainage pipe. Up. There's also one right there. Okay. And the way I'm looking at it is your actual fence line where you got your patio. That actual footage comes up to the easement. You're just barely at the edge. So this easement right here, that is basically shared common area. Right. As long as it's not blocking that drainage right there, these were them well rights to that fence. Now here's the other thing. You can survey it all you want, you're going to have to take any small planes for it, and you're going to lose. And we got it. Because there's an easement. 
I'm telling you. I, 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 live, I live peacefully. I, I live my best life, okay? My best life. I don't bother nobody. And, uh, and, and I, I expect no one to bother me while I live. I'm going to peace. We accepted your apology. You kept on going. I have you recorded. I'm good. Just y'all apologize to him, and you apologize. I apologize because you live the way you live, and I live the way I live. I don't have a problem with you. Don't have a problem. I have a problem with you. You have a problem with me. If you don't have a problem with me, I'm good. You gonna live? You gonna live? I can. You you listen. You can exist without even speaking to me. I can exist without speaking to you. Your life, your quality of life, won't affect. Won't be affected by my face. Exactly. So with that said, be be peace. Be at peace. I'm, I'm at peace. I am too. Okay, I'm good. I just don't, I'm not used to somebody just shutting me down. I'm not used to me. Alright, well, you got it. You got it. I listen to you. And like I said, if this is your property, it's your property. You got it. You're absolutely right. You got it. And I. I don't have anything. I'm done talking. Are you? That's fine, sir. You know when you're I'm done. I'm done talking. All right. All right. Good day. No more friends. Good day. Yep. Looks like they are moving. Karen is leaving the neighborhood. You know, uh, good thing comes to, to good people. Bad things come to bad people. Looks like now they were ordered to pay back taxes, and they also sell in their house. <laughs> we'll see you. Karen demands first responders move their car because she claims they're blocking her in. Hi, ma'am. What's your uh, what's your view on all this? I think that he needs to move. Who the ambulance? Blocking. Yeah. Because he's move. blocking you in. Yeah. So the ambulance here dealing with the same victim should move because you're inconvenient. The world is not going to stop. If that was critical, they wouldn't be sitting in a parking yeah, lot it's not doing critical, that. Right? Yeah. Okay. So. Hmm. Why are you harassing first responders doing their job, though? No, I asked them to move. I wasn't harassing. Well, them. you're on. Um... Car Karen is so angry that she storms out of her car and things nearly get physical. What is wrong? What's wrong with her? I'm sorry, this is my mother. And your mother's acting like Okay. Okay. So how about that? And you need to stop recording me because the more you record me, I'll record her. I'm sorry, I'm just a little concerned because- I'm a little concerned too because she's honking at me. How does she like to be honked at? Exactly. Thank you very much. I don't know what happened. You don't even know what happened, but she can tell you what happened. All and right. it was just a split second when I looked down. I wasn't even on my damn. Okay, for I'm her sorry. For honking at me like maybe, a grown ass woman. Maybe She's older was, than me and wants to ride maybe my ass. There I don't care. Was a miscommunication. I don't, I don't give a. Lying. I don't. I'm so sorry. Get in I the car. Get you. in the car. Oh, that ass. Hey, 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 that ass. What? I slapped her because she was coming at you, Mom. Oh, I know. That's fine. I'm not mad at Salty you. Salty fans. Hi, I want to press charges against somebody who just slapped me. In Salty fans. What the heck? Um, it's all on video. Don't worry. It's work. all on video. I have no idea, but they're videotaping me and they want to see me. Wanna... How can I no, get I'm in trouble for that? The address is right there, Doug. And she keeps calling me names and out of my oh, name, and I don't appreciate that. Law. So it's uh, 270. Hey, she go back away. I'm at yeah. 270. And I honked. I went beep. And oh, ever since then, she's been oh, following, following you road rage. Yes. 
Okay. Yeah, no, I don't have road rage. You sound pretty upset to us. No, because you guys don't know the story, and she's not telling the truth. You guys are listening to what story? What did I do? Did I call? See, do you hear this? They're I all at you. Right They're all making me mad. I called at you. And you're crying. And her daughter's she's coming at my mom. So I need someone to slap you because you scared me. You came at my mom. Uh, she's a minor, by the way. You're a, you're an adult tech and a minor lady. And I didn't touch nobody. It sounds like you went at her. Really? Because you what's this street? Me. What's this street name? Yes. Okay. Go to the end of the street and find out. I'm on. I'm, I'm on Yuma. No, you're not. But go ahead. Yep. Are you gonna be in trouble? No. I don't know this near. She scared the crap out of me. She got out of her car and ran at you. No, you're self defense. You're fine. And you're a minor. She can't. You know. I'm sorry. I thought she was gonna hurt you. I know. It's okay. She's crazy. I believe so. If that's Where's what you're feeling. Selfish Karen gets upset over this man walking his service dog. Ma'am, please, please, please. I don't know why you think you're better than everybody. I don't. I you don't. Do. But there's laws you against do. this. You're discriminating no, against me. I am not. There's laws against you this. You think you're better than everybody There's laws else. against this. I don't. No, there nope. is not laws against there's re this. There's, you are yes, not there above the law. Karen in the wild tries to chase this guy teasing her while on his electric scooter. There's a wild Karen. Yes, I'm very wild. Very wild. Look at her! She's chasing me! You can't catch me! Karen gets angry these men are fishing and causes a massive fuss over nothing, threatening to call the local sheriff. Uh huh? Let's do a little fishing. See that sign out there? Yes, sir. No fishing. Can't stop people from fishing here. I've already contacted Florida Fish and Wildlife. As long as it's a navigable water, by the way, you can't stop them. And if you don't want to move, you rent the from Florida. No, you rent the docks. Reality. Ours, and it's actually in the contract. Okay. I mean, so you, we, right do you want me to call the sheriff real quick? Cause I can't. Ancient Karen gets enraged about who knows what. Anything triggers a Karen these days. Don't you look at me like I that. What you think? I've been trying to take care of that for two weeks because you do it. Because my you don't. Okay. Good. Neighbor Karen calls the cops on this woman and she calls the Karen out to her face. Okay, next time you have a problem, don't call the cops because that does absolutely nothing for you whatsoever. They say it's four o'clock on a Sunday on a holiday weekend. What did you think they were going to do? Tell me to be quiet? You could have done that. But now I'm pissed off. Okay, like I'm, I try to be quiet, but I have two kids. If you have a problem with living in a multifamily apartment complex, then move. I've been here longer, you move. Well, I'm not gonna move. So if you have such I'm a big problem with me, either. then move. Okay, then stop complaining. Karens aren't happy they put a basketball hoop on the pavement near their house and tried to remove it to stop these kids from having fun. No. Right. Sure. sorry, this is not your property. It's not, not your property. It's not your property. This is not your property. It's not your property. It's not your property, sir. Yes, this is my art. What is it? Uh, it's theirs. It's, it's not theirs. your property, sir. Leave it alone. This is not your property. We have, we have, we have. Leave it. Leave it. What's your wife? Yeah, that's your wife, huh? What's your wife? We're kids. You know that, You are my wife. Yes, that's how you Yeah, and his wife. Are you highly excited? Are you, I'm his husband. We're gay together. We're gay together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least we have a happy marriage, you know? You know what? You know what? You know what? I want him. Yeah. Yeah, you're me. Boy, he's, he's home. Say no more. This is my home. The street is my home. I own the street. Who am I? I'm, uh, my name is uh, Jacob, you know? My name is Jacob. None of, that's none of your business, ma'am. Oh, no. oh. oh my god! Such a big thing, buddy! Buddy, you did such a big thing! You did such a big thing! I'm so sorry, I'm sorry, buddy. Can you go over this? 
Come on, gang. Come on, gang. That is so cool. Oh, my God. He's coming to our home. Oh, my God. I'm not saying. What's your age? Then why are you are telling Yo. this bad word? I'm 14. Yo. Angry Karen caught yelling at another driver for throwing his cigarette butts out the window. Parking Karen goes crazy at this man who's calmly trying to deal with her rants. Karen demeans this worker, calling him lazy and treating him like dirt. I'm going to do another uh, FedEx work, but if I have two boxes, I'm not putting that skid there because then we run into issues. You're too lazy to get off your thing, get the pallet jack, move it properly back to where I have it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, rewind. Don't call me lazy. Oh. Okay, because I'm not lazy. Yeah, you are. Okay, see the thing. I'm, the see, see now let's get. See, you say things instead of coming back here and saying something nice and saying, "Hey, listen, don't mess with my boxes until I'm gone," which is all you had to say. But now you want. That. But now you want to say because other stuff. You shouldn't have to do but you're saying. But you're, uh, you, 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 you already made that clear. You already made that clear. You don't have to say other stuff. So why today? I mess with your boxes, okay. so that makes me lazy. Whoa, 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 whoa. I mess with your boxes, that made me, that makes no, me lazy. No, that's not even I said, so you didn't even get the point. But you're telling me I'm lazy. No, that's not what I said. You say, I don't have to get off the forklift because you're lazy. Yes. That's what you said, yes. right? Yes, because you like to push stuff up because it was very obvious because Andrew even saw it. You just push stuff Why up. Why are you talking about time. stuff that happened so months ago? Because we haven't had an issue with anything in months. You're talking about yeah, that happened years ago. Okay. I'm not doing anything again. Okay. I just put the boxes on top of the skid because I don't want to get off the forklift and take the boxes that you have on the floor and put them on, on a right, skid. I'm done. And the reason why just separate the, 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 the why I don't it is separated. It's on the floor. The reason why I don't have two skids is because of that whole issue. So I So all of a sudden now you made a decision that you don't want two skids, then why didn't you say that then? Been, no. You didn't come to me and say, Hey Manny, I'm only gonna have one skid from now on. I'm not gonna See, you're not even listening to me because that's not what I said. That is not. You just what said, I said that you're gonna have one skid, and if, if there's two, only two, you only two FedEx boxes, you're gonna leave them on the floor. That's, that's what right. you said, right? That's right. Yeah. But I said if there's multiple, more than two boxes, I can. Can you do me a favor and back up? No. 
Back, back away from me. You got a mask on. I don't care. Back away from me. There. Away from me. Six feet. I am. I don't. No, you're not. Yes, you're am. in my personal space. I am. Six Get from me. I am six feet. Back up. No, this is not six feet. Yes, it is. Just leave. I'm telling you. From me.